battle report. It's an 1850 relic, but it's got a special rule that, that gives... I got the relic um, on round one, and I, and I get to choose the unit it's worth with. Uh, it's night fighting, hammer and anvil, and it's sisters with dark Eldar allies versus um, chaos space marines of the uh, pre-heresy. On the sisters' side, there's a bunch of battle sisters with the relic in a rhino with a melta and a multi melta. There are two exorcists, a squad of penitent engines, St. Celestine and Seraphin in reserve, Dominions in an immolator in reserve, and um, a bunch of battle also sisters in reserve. <coughs> um, and then the Dark Eldar allies have a uh, Ravager, five cowboy warriors in a raider, ten trueborn with blasters and carbines and cannons in a raider, four blasters, three reavers, one of them has a heat lance, and then on your side you got. Predator? Predator with Las Cannon, Las Cannon, Las Cannon, Las Cannon. Uh, squad of cast space marines with uh, additional close combat weapons and veterans yeah. of the long war, a chaos lord with a digital of corruption, power fist, burning brand, mark of zinch, and gift of mutation. Uh, that guy's awesome. Is that the warlord? Yeah. That is the warlord, that okay. The warlord. He also grants, um, even though they would normally only hate space marines, he has hatred of everything. Okay, so he hates everyone. He hates everyone. Equally. Um, I have two hellbrutes with reaper auto cannons and uh, heavy flamers in their power fists. Yep, we got Land Raider. Land Raider Proteus with uh, two twinling glass cannons, a uh, twinling heavy bolter in its uh, hull mount, a uh, pencil mounted heavy bolter and havoc launcher. I have a forge fiend, forge fiend. with uh, two Hades auto cannons and a ectoplasma cannon. It's from dust. Yep. Then another, then another cast marine squad that's the same as that one, except that instead of a uh, cast lord, it has a level three sorcerer with a sigil of corruption. And then the Mauler and then the Mauler fiend. And you have nothing in reserve, right? Nothing in reserve. But you are, we haven't done scouting yet, and this is night fighting. I forgot that I didn't have the initiative, so we've uh, we've redeployed a little bit, and now um, we're gonna do scout moves, of which I don't have any. So Proteus there, scout moved, and uh, we're gonna see if the Dark Eldar sisters can steal the initiative. So movement is done. Uh, pretty much, these guys are just marching forward on round one. Yeah, everything came forward. Yeah, yay! All right, we're gonna see some shooting. He's a mediocre quality. All right, so round one, first blood has been given to the Chaos Marines because they blew up the Raider that was getting a two-up cover save back there. I was I was inside of 36 inches, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. So it was night fighting, and it blew up from one auto cannon hit. Uh, and then two penitent engines exploded, and one of them's left with two hull points there. Yeah, it's not going well for the, the sisters, Dark Eldar, and we're going we're gonna to move on to their turn. So sisters, dark held are there. This is your dice. Don't want to steal it there. Uh, <laughs> it's night fighting, but these guys roll forward. We just left that wreckage there. We got one faith point, forward. which isn't gonna matter. Move, move there. They sh do their bike move, and uh, penitent engine is here, and we're on to shooting, and the penitent engine's gonna run. Two inches. There's a mistake there. Those there were no reavers. They they just die. They they, they crashed and died. They weren't in this 1850 so, point list. So, um, nothing happened much on the sisters' Dark Eldar side. They, uh, well, they do glance the predator and glance... Yeah, pend it, so he's stunned or shaken, lost one hull point, and one hull point off that, uh, fiend, and, and killed a single Chaos Marine. Yeah, and, uh, we're on to, uh, Chaos round two. Uh, it's pretty much as expected. Chaos Marines continue to move forward. So Mahler Fiend, that just pivoted or didn't move at all? It, it, it didn't move at all. Didn't move at all. That guy moves back a little bit. These guys come forward. Those guys come forward. But Auto Cannon remains where it is. That thing was shaken, so it, it can't move. And those two Hell Brutes over there, they uh, they came forward, and we're going to see what happens with shooting. But so far, it's shooting, not going well for the shooting sisters. Shooting is not going well for the sisters. It's going really well for Chaos Space Marines. You'll notice uh, Raider is gone. Raider is gone, as are three guys with shard carbines. Dad Exorcist has been glant, oh uh, no, pen, but it, it's just shaken, so it can't move, which is fine for an exorcist. But it's 
Snap shooting, which is nice. It's snap shooting, yeah. And uh, did anyone else die? There was a lot of uh, shooting. Oh, the Pennington engines. You'll notice there are no Pennington engines because they all died. And uh, yeah, sad day for the sisters. So we're going to see what happens with the charge. You're, you're making one charge here, right? All right, do you get an 11? I am fleet. I'll re-roll those. Okay. Drop oh, six. No, six. Six. Oh, thank God now. So the Sisters Dark Eldar here, they got six faith points, which is amazing. Only thing that came in from reserve were those dominions in the emulator. These guys moved out of their crater a little bit, spread out. Well, they didn't really spread out, but they're trying to get close to use their weapons. These guys came out of their crater, they're moving up. That exorcist can't move at all. This thing rotated a little bit in the back corner. That guy moves here so that it's going to force cover saves. And we're on to uh, actual shooting. Yeah, in the pathetic... The sisters are just just dying here. Oh, we're going to see if these guys run. See them run. Nine! No. Unfortunate. Uh, so what did the sisters accomplish? Not much of anything. We glanced this, smaller fiend, with a crack grenade. Not the Meltas. The multi-Melta hits this, gets nothing. Um, we used one faith point. Which doesn't matter because we're not going to use any more this round. Uh, these guys with the blasters and stuff, they killed like a guy. Right? Was it one guy? Yeah, one guy. Those guys ran. Exorcist does nothing. Exorcist actually killed some guys. Killed four guys. That's about it. The sisters are doing really poorly, so we're on round three now. And uh, we're going to see what happens to the Chaos Marines. The continuing of, of the slaughtering of the sisters. Uh, this thing moves. Those guys are coming up. They're probably going to flame someone. These guys are coming forward. Mahler Fiend is standing one inch away from that exorcist, so it can't fail its charge. Uh, the, everyone's coming up here. It looks like they're all staring at a bunch of Dominions. And, uh, yeah, we're on to shooting for round three. All right, so uh, end of three shooting. Rhino explodes, killing four girls. But the one with the, uh, the, the HQ here with the uh, relic is still standing. These guys lost one which wasn't enough to make them run. These guys, Trueborn, are left with a blaster and a, a cannon. Or is that a shard? Cannon! And uh, there's a Dominion fleeing. And there's a shaken emulator over there. And then uh, we're on to the assaults where uh, uh, we're going to see what happens. Who's assaulting? Yeah, so how many hits does he get? Oh! Oh, yeah. Right. And then over here, or do we do that and then we move them? Later? Do ahead and do okay. that. See how many, how badly do you, do you hurt me? Uh, wow, one one hit. hit. But I get an extra Melta shot, which hits. Melta or? It's a Melta blast. Right? Oh, Melta. Melta. Damn it. Okay. So his first strength, 10 hit. Yep. Pens, and then pens. Melta hit. Pens. Pens. All right. So the two pens. Does the Emperor love me? Nope. And so uh, it blew up. All right, so this is now an explosion. All right, and then uh, these guys are going to overwatch the first unit that goes against them. I'm going to reroll this. All right. Still not going to make it. And do I hit you? No. The other one. It's definitely 3D6, though, because... I can hit that first guy. He's standing in a crater, yeah. So it's a six-inch... Okay, so he's fleet. Yeah. So, eight inch charge. That's six inches. You're not. You're not gonna make it. No. Nope. All right. So they're still alive, just by the skin of their teeth, and we're on to the bottom of round three. The bottom of three, right? Bottom of three. Uh, Saint Celestine has not come in yet. Coming in are a whole squad of girls just spread two inches apart off the edge of the table. This squad here hands the relic over, and a couple of them move forward, but that guy doesn't move. Um, actually, that guy's going to move an inch, so it could be useful. And then um, these guys move up. Those Trueborn came forward, and uh, eat that immolator. Emulator, since it's only snap fire and moved 12 inches, that Dominion's still running! And the Exorcist comes rolling up on the Mahler Fiend, because what the hell, the Mahler Fiend's going to attack it anyways. So, Sister's movement and shooting is done. These guys, with their shard weapons, killed two people. 
in that squad there. Um, Blaster on that Trueborn took out the Mauler Fiend. Exorcist did nothing. That Immolator was awesome. Even though it snap fired, it took out the uh, Land Raider and then killed the dude with the explosion. Which is an achievement for the League, by the way. Having an exploding vehicle take out one of your guys. Oh, you got that already. Uh, that Dominion, she's just running. Um, and uh, so we've actually accomplished something that was a better than previous average round, so we're on to round four. Predator gonna move? No. Okay, so movement is done. This squad here. By the way, what are these guys? What what army are they? But I mean, what were they? Since they're pre-heresy, what? Sons of Horus. Sons of Horus, okay. So the actual Sons of Horus come coming up here. This one doesn't move. Those guys are really threatening those two Eldar, but the Eldar are going to die at this point. They like pain. Uh, they come forward. It's coming forward, and that's it. So we're on to the bottom of... So shooting, of shooting is done, as is assaulting. Um, this exorcist decided to shoot its own unit because of it was taken over, Puppet Mastery, and didn't deny the witch. Uh, was Puppet Mastery a focus witchfire? Ah, uh, see if you hit me. You might not have hit me. Okay, we're going we're gonna to retcon that in a second. Okay, does he hit? He does. Yeah, he does. Okay, so I do shoot my own guys, killing the two Meltas. And, and then a, a girl with a gun. <laughs> um, those guys beat up a bunch of Dark Eldar Trueborn. The Omoculus and his squad, they evaporated. Uh, so it's pretty much just some sisters in a corner with a relic. And then St. Celestine and her squad are going to come in on the, the bottom of round four. So on the sisters, they got two faith points. St. Celestine lands right there, dead on, which is nice, because that Seraphim squad also has uh, Inferno pistols. These girls come marching up forward, but that one with the multi mouth that doesn't move. These girls kind of slide over towards the corner. They'll probably get knocked off the board, which will be bad. Exorcist moves. And that Dominion rolled a three on her leadership. She did a double one, and then she rolled a double one to move. It's out of order, and uh, so no Dark Eldar left. The Emperor Emperor realized that the Sons of Horus had betrayed him, and, and suddenly changes his mind. Uh, and scariness occurs, so St. Celestine's squad leaves the Warlord and a guy with a, what's that, auto gun? Auto cannon? There, with melta guns and all that killing them. This Hellbrute is immobilized, thanks to a mel melta hit, or multi-melta, they're the same in the squad. Exorcist did nothing. It shot that predator again and nothing. And uh, so we're on the top of five. It can't be night fighting because we already had night fighting around one and waiting to see what happens. And we'll return as a red knot. That's a very popular theory right now. So in terms of movement, oh, no, these did, guys go, he, he, these he guys, he he's immobilized, and that one moved up. The these guys come closer yeah. to Celestine, and that predator is aiming at them, and we're about to enter into so shooting, shooting is round done. Five. This thing, crazy, is taken over again. We're going to have to replace the pilot. It shot its own squad. We're going to find out if those girls run off the board, actually. Uh, eight, we still got our superior, so they do not. And then there was a ton of shooting. St. Celestine's squad, luckily, because of placement, she she lives. As does everybody else. Everyone else, yeah, because the torrent. And uh, these girls lost their Melta, so it's going to be less effective against that thing. And, uh, yeah, are you going to assault? I, Peter just gave up in, in, in dismay because uh, St. Celestine killed his warlord. And uh, it was the bottom of five. It was going to be the bottom of five anyways.